Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Lancelot George and I want to give you a big shout out for clicking on this video. Of course, all my returning subscribers, it's always good to have you back. You know I love you. And yeah, we're about to get up into some holiday looks. I have about five looks to show you that can go for the holiday season. Um, by the time this video goes up, it will already be Thanksgiving, but I hope it's not going to be too late to pull from what I have to show you. Without any further ado, let's jump straight into the video. So the first look is a comfortable, relaxed look where I have a sweatshirt from Zara. It says Bad Co. It's like an acid wash sweatshirt. It's kind of cropped and I've paired it with a pair of jogger pants from Massimo Dutti. I got this years ago. Um, I would say probably six years ago. I found them in Marshalls and they're super, super comfortable. I wash them all the time, but I do not put them in the dryer. They're super comfortable. They have remained in shape over all of these years and I love them. The only thing is they're, they're warm, but not super warm. So if you're going to be outside or traveling, you will definitely need like layering garments like tights or so on. But yeah, this look is going to be perfect if you're just going to be chilling at home or with your family. You know, it's super comfortable. You know, you're going to be eating. You're going to be laughing. You're going to be talking. You know, you know, this is perfect for a family situation or friends, you know, Friendsgiving. If you're just going to be chilling inside the house, you don't want to get too dressed up. You know, your gravy may spill on your clothes and like, hey, it goes downhill from there. So you want to definitely wear something comfortable. I chose um, more darker colors because, of course, we're going to be interacting with with our family we're gonna have i have cousins i have you know it's gonna be a lot of hugging and touching and games and like so you want to be comfortable but you want to wear something that can get messed up and can handle all of that rigmarole um i also choose to pair this outfit i think it was perfect with my new balance it's like grayish creamish new balance it goes perfectly and of course i threw over top a rain coat but it's still warm i got this from h&m um last year it has like that pipe into it and it's super super it's super warm but you know as long as you layer properly next up is uh this more edgy look so this will be perfect for the like a bar or a casual restaurant or lounge it would be great if you're gonna go see family as well because of the dark colors um as well as it would be perfect to have for friends given as well it's super casual but more on the edgy side if you want to get a little bit more dressed up i've paired the champion sweatshirt with a pair of black levi jeans i'm keeping everything dark um of course you can switch this sweatshirt out for a black hoodie and you can switch the jeans out for leather pants if you want to i mean it's gonna be a little bit hot if you're gonna be inside um and there you see me accessorizing with like silver rings just to keep match with the silver hardware on my jacket. My my leather jacket is from my leather jacket is from Coach. Um and I will link the I don't know if they have this one still but i will um definitely see if i can find the link to something that is similar um i love the zipper details on it i love the silver detailing i also threw on accessorized with a beanie and also like this thick silver choker and um silver coach earrings that i found in marshall's as well so i just kept the accessories within the theme of silver and you know very very it's very minimal but at, at the same time it does create a statement i paired it also with a black chelsea heel boot from asos it's leather like just smooth leather chelsea heel boot you could switch this out for black sneakers if you want or black combat boots if you want or you know maybe suede but considering the weather around this time i think it's best to do something that can handle whether it um the snow or the rain uh yeah so i i'm really feeling this look i'm really feeling i want to get back into this kind of dark edgy it this look kind of speaks to me and i'm gonna explore this aesthetic more here i've also switched out because i wanted to give you options as well um you could put a sheer shirt so all my you know my girlies you can do a sheer shirt if you want to make things a little bit sexier you could definitely um do a sheer shirt i've paired it with this one it's very skin tight it's perfect so if you're gonna be out like 
at the lounge per se, you know, listening to music, you know, drinking, this would be perfect because later on you may continue, you know, you can remove the jacket, you can, you know, dance and have a good time. Uh, but if you're going to be around, let's say your family, I think the sweatshirt or a hoodie underneath would be perfect. Of course, you know, you can remove the layer um, on top and then just be super chill and super comfy. But I'm loving this look with the mesh shirt. Super, super sexy, super, you know, it's a little bit revealing, but it also grabs attention, but still remains in the theme of that dark, edgy, sexy kind of look, which is which is typically my style. I I tend to gear more towards blacks and grays, but I do love color as well. And yeah, so this is what we have going on for that second look where we're going to kick things up a notch and make things a little bit more edgier and a little bit more sexier for Thanksgiving. Because who says you can't be sexy for the holidays? I'm definitely into that vibe. Um, yeah, so there I go. Just showing you how to rock the hell out of this jacket with the sheer top underneath which just adds a little bit more texture as well to the look you know and of course the accessories just take it up to another level definitely bad boy bad girl vibe if you are that if that's your aesthetic definitely this is the look to go for and of course i am adding my bag this is a little coin purse from don't remember where this is from, but it I think it, it is from... Uh, I will link it down below. It's a very popular brand. It, they carry a lot of these bags. This is the smallest one, actually. But it, you don't want to bring around anything heavy. You know, just something for your card, something for maybe a mint, and a little bit of coin. You know, that's about that. Now, if we want to just be a little bit more cheerful and add a little bit more color, this is where we're going to pull in... A little bit a little bit more sophistication and tone it down a little bit but still look dressed up and here I've decided to go with um, a blue sweater you could switch this sweater out this sweater is from Brooks Brothers you could definitely switch this blue sweater or the color for another color mate let's say red orange brown Yellow is a great option for the holidays. People tend not to go towards yellow, but I think yellow is a great option as well. Any kind of rich, bright colors, you can definitely put it in. You can definitely swap it out here. But I chose to go with this blue sweater. This is a blue lamb's wool sweater from Brooks Brothers. It has a little bit of uh, cording or uh, cabling. Uh, the cable knit, yeah. It has a bit of cable knit to it. I love how it feels. It's warm, so you'll definitely be warm. I paired it with a pair of off-white cargo pants, wide leg pants, from H&M. So we're not breaking the bank here. We're definitely mixing high and low. And of course, my trench is from H&M as well. But this is ladies. So you'll definitely, with me, you'll see a mixture of masculine and feminine uh, so this trench is from the ladies department, but of course, for my manly man, you can definitely find a trench that it, in, in the men's apartment, or if you already have a trench in your closet, please go ahead and feel free to pull it out. Okay. Yeah. So that's what's up. And I am just, <laughs> I guess I was just walking around trying to figure out what I'm doing here with my coat. But yeah, I love the belt in detail. And that's, <laughs> I don't know why I took up that book. But that's my book that I've been reading, how to how to build a fashion icon or how to, you know, La Roche's book. I, I don't remember the name right now, but La Roche's book, that book, I've been reading it lately. Very, very good book. And if you can get it, if you get a chance to pick it up, go to Barnes and Noble and make sure you pick it up or pick it up online. And yeah, so I paired it with my same leather heel Chelsea boots, accessorized with gold accessories because I think gold would pop with the blue a little bit more on my skin tone. Of course, you can definitely go with silver or any kind of jewelry that you would like. I decided that I wanted to keep my jewelry minimal and, you know, let the sweater and the trench, the clothing speak for itself. And as I was telling you, I love the cable detail on the sweater. 
it is super interesting i just love how it feels the sweater is super lightweight but i'm telling you it this lamb's wool sweater will keep you warm it was price point at like 150 but let me tell you something i found it in marshall's for just under 60 dollars so hey do not be afraid to check out Marshalls and TJ Maxx for your holiday finds and your looks, okay? Yeah, so that's about that. Makeup is minimal. Face is minimal. Um, not doing too much. I accessorize, as I said, with gold jewelry and keeping everything minimal. I love the details on this cargo pants. It always looks good. You can pull it with anything. It goes with any color because it's a neutral color. And here I'm just going to show you how I wanted to style it with the, because I totally forgot that I wanted to style it with my white Dr. Martens. Um, these combat boots are perfect for the weather, you know, around this time, it, as I said before, it may be snowing, it may be raining, and today, yes, it's Thanksgiving, and it is actually raining, and I actually wore those shoes today to visit my aunt and my family, so it's perfect for if you're gonna be traveling outdoors and you know you need something to weather the storm these boots would be perfect it blends in nicely it sets the it definitely coordinates with the pants and the entire look it makes me look a little bit taller because it's still in that color range of white off white cream so you know it will make you appear taller if you if you layer if you do the color coding that way um just fixing as I, I like to I, I i've been getting into like oversized sweaters i love me a little oversized slouchy i feel like i'm gearing more towards that and more so you know like comfy but still dressed up now we're looking we're going into <laughs> look number three and this is no 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 this is look number four and this is a semi-casual business casual look you know it's more suitable for like a work-related or a professional thanksgiving event um i am so what i'm wearing right now i have this phineas cole uh dress shirt uh, Finis Cole by Four Paul Stewart. Um, I it's like red, red and white stripe, and it has like a white neckline, a white collar. Uh, love, 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 but unfortunately, I can't button the collar because my neck is too big. But I love the shirt so much. I generally don't button my collars, but you know, I would love to so you could see the detail of it and see how beautiful it would look buttoned. But I still think it works. It I I, I like to show a little bit of chest so i that's me i never really button up my shirts all the way up so if you want to if you want to button up your shirt go, fine go ahead this is just inspiration um yeah so i've kept my same gold jewelry i've threw i threw on a, a blue sports coat the sports coat is from calvin klein um I have the pants for it as well. So if you do want to switch out the jeans, because I paired this look with Levi jeans, not to be too serious. It's Thanksgiving. It's the holidays. Who want to be so uptight and, you know, for you are uptight all week at work. You want to, you know, let your hair down a little bit. So I have decided to pair it with these blue indigo Levi jeans and the blue um, sports coat, which, you know, coordinates in that capacity. Um, if you want, you could... Definitely wear a matching pants for the sports coat. Uh, I would say, <clears throat> excuse me, I would say um, this look would go nicely with brown boots, but I don't have any because my boots that I ordered did not come in. So I had to pair it with um, black suede boots from Aldo. Uh, so now I'm showing you a look that I would more than likely wear where I switch out the sports coats for a Academia cardigan. This one I got from Forever 21 about four years ago. And I love, 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 love this cardigan so much. I love the ribbing. I love the colorful details, the burgundy, the blue, the cream. It's beautiful. It blends right back in to match the shirt and the jeans that I'm wearing. Uh super 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 cozy and relaxed so it does have that relaxed element i try to incorporate a little bit of a relaxed element in my 
wardrobe lately. I've been doing a lot of relaxed looks. And I think this would be the look that I go for over the sports clothes because it, it just feels so me and it's comfortable. And of course, you can remove this at the dinner and, you know, just be be easy and be chill. You don't, you know, it still looks put together without the sports clothes or without the cardigan. But of course, if you're going to be walking outside, if you're going to be traveling you know by public transport i think the cardigan would add a little bit of layer and a little bit of warmth and of course please don't forget your coat you know if you have a car coat if you have whatever a trench you could throw it on top just to wear outside while you're going to the event but yeah i think this look is pretty cool i think it is very much appropriate for any kind of work related or professional thanksgiving event you know, it's, I think it's just perfect. You don't have to, you don't have to overdo it. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to get super dressed up for work event. You know, just keep it business casual. Just keep it business casual. As you see, I'm rolling up my sleeves just to style it the way how I would want to style it, how I feel comfortable. You know, you can style it however you want, but this is just to show you how I would put it together to make it my own of course you can do the same put it together to make it your own now we're going to turn things all the way up and we are going for that statement or formal evening look so this look is going to incorporate a statement pant a jacket or a blazer and a shirt underneath or a blouse underneath if you're a female you know you can switch this out for a dress or a skirt and a top however you want but this one is definitely for that statement dinner that special dinner with bay you know date night on thanksgiving or if you have let's say like a charity event and you need to get dressed up here i have a mock neck turtleneck in black and yes we're keeping this look dark because dark is always appropriate for anything that is formal anything that is says date night we want it to be of course we want to make a statement we want to look sexy we want to look put together and we just want to say hey hello we're here at this party we i have this black this is a black dinner jacket from h&m so we're not breaking the bank again and it, i keep it on the matte side i like the satin lapels it does blend in with the sequins on the pants and also the velvet look of the mock neck uh long sleeve t-shirt from asos the pants are from asos as well i got these pants probably i would want to say three to four years ago i'm not sure if they do have the same exact pants but of course they always make versions of it it's velvet so sequin on velvet very very elegant very sophisticated very much a statement every time i wear these pants it's a statement i kept the jewelry simple kept my gold jewelry i love gold gold looks so so rich on my skin tone and um yeah as you can see the silhouette is very simple it's very clean uh we're not doing a lot the makeup is clean as well i decided to just keep my makeup clean you know simple with the hair and you know as for my ladies you could do just an up do a simple ponytail um you know my men you can definitely do a caesar cut get your beard trimmed like just keep it clean for this kind of look because it's something formal we definitely want to look clean we want to look put together yeah so it's all about the clean lines it's all about the textures because of course we want to incorporate different textures so that it catches the eyes you know we don't want to go to a party and then no one gives us a compliment you know not that it should matter but of course you want to go out and someone say hey you look really nice and i feel like this look would be that look where people would definitely come up to you and say hey you're looking really really good i mean look at this this is from asos and h&m and we are not breaking the bank but it looks like we have spent a lot of money and it looks like you know we're here to party and we're here to have fun because these pants are fun these pants are so much fun they are eye catching it catches the light perfectly so you see how we when we walk it just catches the light 
this is what you want for that dinner with Bay or for that charity event or for that formal Thanksgiving event. You definitely want to go with something like this. And sequins is always good around this time of the year. I love me some sequins. I don't care what anyone says. I love me a good sequin moment. As long as it doesn't look cheap, I love me a good sequin moment. Sequin will always be a moment. And yeah, so... Out of all these looks, I think this one is my absolute favorite. It's dark. It's sexy. It's still comfortable because it's not, the pants are not tight. The shirt is not tight. The shirt, everything is on the relaxed side. So you're going to be comfortable sitting. You're going to be comfortable standing. You're going to be comfortable dancing. You know, it's, at this point in life, I'm going for comfort. Not all the time, but most times I am going for comfort. And you see, it's just really, really elegant. It embodies grace. It, em it embodies sexiness. It embodies... So yeah, that's the five looks that I have for you. I hope you find one of these looks inspiring or appropriate to go to your Thanksgiving or holiday event. And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Of course, thank you so much for joining and thank you for watching. And always... Be safe, enjoy the holidays, and hit that subscribe button if you're not yet subscribed. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.